This is a two-dimensional heat transfer model in Excel. In the previous uh, video preview, I presented a one-dimensional model. This uh, simulates the transfer within a square uniform plate. Let's start the model from this button. You can see the temperature redistributing within the plate. We can reset it any time. We don't even need to stop it. We can pause it from here or start it, start it again. There are several um, worksheets with various temperature profiles, various initial conditions and ambient conditions. Let's close this and uh, go to my blog here, excelunusual.com and in the search box type heat transfer hit return and uh, a bunch of results will come up a series of results there's the previous one dimensional heat transfer model that we presented in the previous video uh, there's also a four part series of tutorial heat transfer modeling for the average Joe you can uh, follow along with this and uh, you know the tutorial this is for a one-dimensional model. And then the next one is a two-dimensional, basic two-dimensional animated heat transfer model, which is a diffusion model 2. And uh, hit on it, uh, I mean click on the title, and it brings you to the post itself. And the post uh, on the top of the thumbnail, which shows the several situations you have there in the model. You can see, um, you can read what the model contains and how to use it. And also you can download it from here by clicking on this Excel download icon. So open it, allow, and this is it. Let's go to the first worksheet. This is a 30 by 30 element uh, plate. It reset start, and the temperature will go to zero because the ambient is zero. Let's pause it, go to the next one. This one is the same initial conditions, just the ambient looks like a bucket, like a square bucket. Another thing I want you to see is if you hold control down, or control uh, the control key down, and scroll the mouse, you can see four matrices. One is the with the current conditions, the previous conditions, and here is the um, ambient temperature. You see the bucket here, 700, 700, and 0 in the middle. So you can, uh, you can type by hand or just copy and paste, you know, by dragging, you know. And also the initial temperature. You can see here 900 over all this area and the rest is 0. So you can just type a 0, whatever temperature you want, then you uh, drag and copy, drag, you know, whatever. I'm going to undo this. So... Let's start this model. And you see you get a sombrero type structure because the ambient has raised edges, it's like a bucket. Let's reset it again, see what happens. <coughs> reset it, pause it. The next model is still a 30 by 30 uh, element plate, uh, but the amb ambient is like a non horizontal plane, it's a raised at a corner plane. So let's start this one and you can see the temperature, uh, the heat redistributes and you get somewhere to a closely to a tilted plane, the final temperature. Let's reset it again, see mo one more time. Okay, that's what happened. See this corner is raising its temperature because the ambient is higher temperature here. Okay, the next model contains a, a bucket. It's just a square bucket, and the ambient is zero, a flat. Let's reset it. Start. This is a fast, a fast little model. See here, and the uh, next one is a cross. See here, I didn't even draw the ambient. Ambient, I believe I put it at zero. Let's check it out. You see the the ambient is zero all all along, all across, and the initial temperatures 
you can create whatever profile you like. I just uh, take a, took a 700 and uh, paste it by dragging it and essentially I started with zero everywhere and then created this 700 cross and that's the model that started see what happens reset it again reset it again to see even better and the last one is a 50 by 50 model um, this is a little bit bigger I wanted to play with the resolution and start this one these are just three blocks and you see the temperature just redistributes between them set set all right so come over to my site excelunusual.com download the model check out the tutorials thanks for watching